In pleading guilty, Chicago and David Headley confessed to scouting targets for the 2008 Mumbai attacks, which killed more than 160 people, including six Americans. The attacks were planned and carried out by the Pakistan-based terror group Lashkar-e-Taiba. But today in court, Headley testified publicly for the first time that Lashkar had support from the Pakistan intelligence services, the ISI. Quote, they coordinated with each other, Headley said under oath, ISI provided assistance to Lashkar. He provided no other immediate details. Headley was the lead-off prosecution witness against his former friend, Tahawar Rana. Rana, who ran a business aimed at helping immigrants, denies any involvement in the Mumbai plot. But prosecutors today countered that Rana not only knew of the attacks, he approved of them and agreed with them. The case, though, is much bigger than Rana. Headley's testimony, as it unfolds, threatens to further stress U.S.-Pakistan relations, especially if Headley provides the names of high-ranking Pakistani authorities with provable links to terrorists. You have a question as to whether or not the Pakistani government, the intelligence services, the military, were complicit in the run-up and the execution of the Mumbai attacks. Now, Headley's also had admitted dealings in the past with al-Qaeda, so he's likely going to be asked what he knows, if anything, about potential links between Pakistani officials and top terror leaders like Osama bin Laden. Russ? Bob Orr in Washington. Thank you very much.